Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be planning in my Erin Condren for the week of June 18th through the 24th and I'm going to be using another Formless Designs kit and this one is watermelon themed. So I'll just show you what it has in it really quick. Half boxes, all of these doodads, functional sheet, um, ombre heart checklist and these the box things uh, so these kits don't come with everything that I need for a spread so I pulled out um, two things of washi and a bunch of other stuff that you guys will see I actually found a whiteout runner at the Dollar Tree so I am going to try that today see if it's better than this uh, big one because I am just not a fan so I don't wanna... oh that how 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 does a whiteout that I purchased for a dollar like the big ones not expensive but it's more than a dollar. How is this one smoother and more, I feel like it's more opaque than the other one. 21st is the um, first day of summer, the um, summer equinox, I believe. And my lord, does it already feel like it's been summer? Like, okay, I don't know. The, the weather in Nebraska, is the craziest thing. I felt like our summer started like mid-May, which is insane because our winter didn't end until like the end of April. So we had like two weeks of spring. <laughs> yeah, and this past winter was, was like six months of perpetual winter. It was ridiculous. As far as I'm concerned, our winter last year started in October when it snowed on Halloween. So that wasn't like the best thing ever in my opinion. I'm just gonna go ahead and put my date covers down and I actually took out date dots this time you guys. You should be so proud of me. I actually brought out date dots. I think I put dates. Oh, I haven't even put dates on this week yet. I'm, I'm horrible. I'm horrible. Oh, I can't with myself. I mean, I'm going to have to use these ones. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to throw those ones on because if I don't, it, it'll never get done. And it's not like I won't ever know how to, I'll never be able to figure out what dates those were. I mean, obviously there's a monthly calendar in here and so that would be pretty easy plus if the weeks before and after are dated then obviously I'll know when it started and when it ended but you guys I'm the worst when it comes to putting date dots on my spreads I, I swear I feel like I always forget them when I'm filming and then I say oh I'll, I'll go back and I'll do it off camera and then I get busy doing something else or filming another video and I just never do and honestly I hadn't even noticed this week that there were no date dots and that's just my life right now um things have been pretty crazy the last few days my husband deployed on today Saturday he deployed on Thursday evening so um, actually, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and nah, I'll do it off camera. I will. I swear. I promise I'll do it. Okay. Jeez. Stop pestering me. All right. So there's only two colors of, um, the, there's only two colors in this kit of the heart checklist. And I hadn't realized that. But I do still want to try to color block. Brought out three different colors of um, of these majiggers, but I'm not gonna have enough. I'll have enough of this pink one, which is honestly like such a perfect match. 
but I don't know if I should just like use both of these greens which is probably what I'll end up doing because there's literally no other I mean there's like a, a limey yellowy green but I don't have a thing for that like a color for that plus in the heart checklist there's only two colors so I brought out silver to use with it too I think I'm just going to use these three I think that's what I'm going to do Okay, so I'll do like this green, and then I'll do a pink. No, pink should have been for, oh, it doesn't really matter. Okay, and then I'll do this green. I can get these off because these were cut a long time ago back when I was still like trying to figure out my silhouette so like a long long time ago so some of them aren't cut perfectly but they're still usable so I'll just alternate between these two greens and I should have enough of the pink to just keep throwing this pink on here Luckily, this paper that I used, it's different than this one that I have. This one's a lot thicker. So on things like this, I have like a straight edge. If they're not ripping apart properly, I can just bend them and they like break apart. I don't know, but it's different than the, the glossy paper that I use now, which is funny though, because they're from the same company and I'm pretty sure they're they're actually the same, well they're supposed to be the same type of paper, which is strange, so I don't know. You guys, I just don't know. I really need to get on my memory planning. I really want to do a live stream. I know I had mentioned a while ago that I wanted to do one and that I was going to do one. I just never had a chance and now that my husband is deployed and my son's not in school or daycare, the only time that I have to do it is at night after he goes to sleep. So it's not like I could do multiple like times to get lots of different countries like to be able to get, to be able to allow a lot of people to watch it actually live I mean I can save it to my YouTube so you can watch it anytime after that but I wanted to do a live and like get caught up on all of my or at least a big chunk of my memory planning that just never happened I really still want to do it I just don't know when I'm gonna be able to which really stinks um, so if you guys wouldn't mind doing a like well for people in the US it'll be like a nighttime one I don't know about other countries obviously the times will be different for different parts of the world but um, come on Is that something you guys would still be interested in? Because I know I took a poll on Instagram a while back when I was first talking about it. And a lot of people said they would be interested. But I'm just interest I'm interested to see if you're still interested. Mm. I'm so eloquent, aren't I? I literally had to rip myself away from the TV to come and film my videos for this week because I was watching American Pickers and I feel like when my husband's home I don't really get to watch my shows very much not as much as a like I don't get to be the one that chooses what we watch well I mean that doesn't make sense 
I don't get to watch things that only I can want to watch, like American Pickers. Nobody else wants to watch that, so I'm left all alone. All right, that's, that's a lot of pink and green. This is going to be a lot of pink and green, isn't it? Oy, oy, oy. Okay, so wipe these lines out. I just feel like this is so much smoother than the big white out. Am I nuts? Can you guys tell, probably can't, but can you guys tell a difference, like, watching it on camera as I'm rolling it out? Does it look like it's going on smoother? I don't know, I'm probably crazy. Now this little tape thing does kind of like slide off a little bit. There's nothing like there's no bumper here or anything really. Not at the very tip to keep it on. And it's kind of loose but as long as you're going kind of slow it doesn't really matter I don't think. I think that's all I need to white out. Okay. I'm going to put this one at the bottom and this one at the top. So I'm going to do this one first. Now, neither one of these are a perfect match, but, you know, I'm working with what I've got, so. Sorry if my head gets in the frame. You gotta work with what I got. Which I don't mind. I really am excited about just using up the things that I have in my stash and not buying anything new unless it is something that um i need so like i need to buy some new 12 by 12 albums because all of oops i should probably do this right side up um because all of the ones that i have are filled so this why is this side like giving me so much trouble this time I don't, why is this so difficult for me did i do it like this last time how did i do this What was that you were saying? Oh yeah. So trying not to buy things unless I need them. Um, and I feel like I go through phases like where I just want to buy all the things and I'm just like I want to buy everything and I want to collect and I just want to I want it all. Give it to me. And I feel like I go through those phases and then after a while I get so overwhelmed with all the stuff I have it's like all of a sudden it hits me and I'm like oh my god how did this happen and I just want to purge everything and I just want to use everything up and I don't want to buy anything and right now I'm in the I don't want to buy anything phase <laughs> not unless I absolutely need it um because my office is just a mess right now. Um, I know I had mentioned before the possibility of me doing a like um, messy office tour and then like cleaned up office tour, like a before and after type thing. I've decided not to do the before um, just because I just feel like that honestly it would be a little bit redundant. Um, but also I just I haven't had a chance to film it and I just got started to get so sick of the mess that I just started it's not like I hadn't been trying to clean it just because I wanted to film a video of my office being messy I just hadn't had time and I figured you know if I get a chance to film it before I get a chance to clean it then I'll do that but honestly now that I say that out loud that doesn't make any sense at all um, but I have started to organize my office and it makes me so happy, so happy that it's getting organized. 
uh, messes drive me absolutely insane. They give me a lot of anxiety. So it just makes my heart happy to be able to clean it up. So um, I'm going to be getting a few more um, organizing like little furniture type things um, to finish up organizing my office. And then once I'm done with that, I'm going to film a completed office tour. Okay. The full boxes. I think I'm going to figure out what I want here first. Actually, I need to do my little things first, don't I? Yes, I do. All right. This is going to be interesting. I think I'll use the two lighter greens. Uh, uh, yeah, for sure. I don't know what I'm going to do for the pinks. That'll be interesting. Okay. I need to figure out what I'm going to do for the pink. I'll use this one. Let me just do the TVs while I'm here. Mondays. I have American Pickers and Tuesdays is Expedition Unknown. I don't think I have anything that comes on on Wednesdays. So um I think. And then Fridays is uh Ancient Aliens. I don't think I'm going to put my two anime shows on for Saturday and Sunday um, because I do watch those with my husband. Um, I mean, he's like in hog heaven right now because he's in Japan, so he's sending me pictures of all kinds of Japanese things and he's super excited. Oh, perfect. I have more of those. So that's Friday for Ancient Aliens. And then the last. This pink food majigger here. Uh, and then what other... Should I use the peach one? Feel like I'm going to go with peach. Because my only other option really would be this magenta color, which I'm not feeling. I feel like it would just stand out way too much. There's no peach in here, but I feel like it goes better than the magenta woods. Ew. Okay, I'm done with those. Let me get my glitter headers on here. I didn't even think about speeding this part up. I definitely could have because I feel like, did I even tell you guys anything useful or important <laughs> in the first half of this video? I I don't even remember, honestly. You can't even remember what I said five seconds ago, can I? Ugh. my full boxes and then I'll decide um, which one I want to put up here because there's no like quote box or one that's extra busy I guess this one but not really though so um, I have a lot going on on Monday so I'm going to put one of these plain ones and then 
think I'm going to put a watermelon one because it's a lot of watermelon in this kit. And the other green one, I'll use the stripes. this one on on the quote box area so that one will go there Monday is really the only day that I've got a ton going on. Uh, so. Ooh. Ooh, my watch is dying. Get a flag. Should I put the peach? Oh, it's like a nude color. It looked peach on the other thing, probably because it was next to something. Peachy, but it's like this nude color. Peachy nude. Maybe I'll put that up at the top. That's what I'm going to do. The other side, I have these ones that I act like these ones are oops ones, they're shorter, but I think that I'm gonna use these over here so that I don't have to cut it off. Actually, it works perfectly. Coolness. Now, my habit trackers, let's do those. I need two habit trackers. I don't have that nude in here, or is it because it's on? No, it's not the same. Um, use this pink, kind of this peachier pink. Neither one of the greens go, they're both too dark. I use both of these. And look at these other. Let's see what header, what headers I have. Okay. I'm going to use the I'm going to do my weekly up here first. So I'm going to use the green don't forget because I want to break up the colors. So that's the only reason I'm putting the green in here. That green, I like this green better a little bit. These weeklies are so long though. But it's fine. Oh my gosh. So my light just flickered. I don't know if you guys saw that. But um, something happened um, last week sometime. Um, yeah, probably probably about a week ago. Maybe like five days ago or so. Um, my I was standing in the doorway of my office facing out of it. Like towards the hallway. And... Um, my husband was taking a picture of me on Snapchat with a Snapchat filter. And it 
um, put a filter on my face and you know how it has the like the facial recognition so if it recognizes another um, another face it'll put the filter on that as well uh, let me see let me get, get one of these put it down here um, and it picked up there's nobody in the office behind me it picked up a face um, in my office behind me and put the filter on it and it freaked my husband out and he before he told me what had happened he said don't move because he was trying to recreate it to try get it to do it again see if there was something in the background that was like making the camera think there was a face there um, he could not recreate it he couldn't get it to do it again um, I, it freaked him out and it was really funny because things do not freak him out easily all right so there's my sidebar I actually really like how that looks so let's see I've got my habit tracker let's get rid of those I need to put let me put a weekend banner down so I can get rid of that too I think I'm going to put this one I feel like this does this kind of match the it's brighter, but kind of matches the green in this washi tape a little bit. Eh, not too much, but whatever. All right, there's my weekend banner. Let me put my build due on Sunday. Um, I think I'll put the dark green one. I just wanted to get sticker sheets out of the way. Oh, Monday I have so much going on. Sorry you guys, my back is killing me. Like the spot in between my spine and my right like shoulder blade on my back has been killing me for like the past couple days and it's been like progressively getting worse and worse and it's just like I think the muscle is just so tight. Um, have you ever had a feeling where like a muscle like it happens to my husband a lot on the top of his foot and it happens to me a lot on my lower back and like the middle of the center upper portion of my back like between my shoulder blades it feels like it needs to crack and to relieve the pressure but it's the muscles are just so tense that you have to really massage it before it'll pop and relieve the pressure and I just obviously like I can't massage the center of my back myself very easily so I'm gonna get a massage on Monday so I need to put that in I am like dying and I've been taking like I I tried taking medicine for it and it's just not it's not working it's not doing anything so that stinks let's see I have a lot of things a lot a lot of things on Monday so I'm going to put in a quarter box. I do have to do my weigh-in, which I actually have to buy a new scale because mine died. I've had it for a long time, so I'm not surprised, but it's dead. I need to get a new one. So I need to weigh in. I need to I'm put a piece of washi because, guys, that's a lot of stuff. I have to go to the bank to, I don't always feel like these go on crooked even though, is it just like the pat, no, that is, is it just the pattern? Maybe it's just the pattern. Um, I need to go to the bank to deposit a check for my sister-in-law. And then... what else I need the American Pickers is on I put that already um, I am having a sale in my shop that starts on the 18th so the day this goes up actually uh, for I believe it's set to 20% off oh wait I'm gonna put another so 20% off the entire shop um, when you're looking at 
the listings and stuff it'll say that you get a discount if you meet the requirements I just set it to a um, like one I think what did I do I was gonna say I think I set it to a one dollar minimum because I picked specific or I think that's the only way you can apply it to the to your entire shop including things that you list after you set the sale up is if you put a minimum purchase requirement I don't know it's weird I'm not really happy with <laughs> a lot of things about Etsy right now and then for my massage I'm going to be putting in a half box because that is importante so I got everything there should be okay yeah got everything Tuesday is payday all the paydays are green but I could put it in a half box put it in a I'm gonna put a piece of washi down there uh only things I have for Tuesday are payday and American and uh, expedition unknown I already put the little thing for expedition unknown so this is all I've got um I need to put another let me see how big this is I'm going to go ahead and put in a quarter box right here and then a piece of washi and then the half box. the payday flag and then I usually just put I don't know I guess I'll put the credit card simple because I know whose payday it is so I don't need to write anything there and then I'll just have the quarter box for anything that pops up uh Wednesday again not much but I need to need to go to Walmart um, to get some more organizational things for my office and then I need to get a present for a birthday party that my son is going to on Saturday which is probably gonna sound weird but I RSVP'd to my son's first birthday party like invite today and it just made me feel so old and I don't know why like that's ridiculous but it just did it just made me feel so old I'm gonna put this scalloped one in here just... oh, can I put it down a little And I can put something there if I need to, but it kind of just blends in as like a washy piece. So that's all I have to put on Wednesday. Thursday, only thing I have. This week is so boring, you guys, but I'm kind of glad I don't have a ton to do except for really Monday. It's Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. Uh, I don't know. I feel like some of these things take up a lot of time though even though there's not a lot of things to do ay, 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 I don't know okay, I'm gonna put a piece of washi here and a quarter box for trash day there's no trash symbol so I'll just grab one from here if I can get to it Garbage, garbage. Do I have like a green one? Nope, I do have a green one. Trash day. I'll put in another um, washi strip. And 
I'll just put it in a half box because you never know when something might pop up. Friday. Uh, filming. Which. Do I want to put it in a. I don't need to. I'll just put it in a quarter box. washi and then this is the last day for the sale that I'm going to be having going on so I'll just put that in a half box just to fill up that space really um, so that's the last day for the sale and then on Saturday I need to edit and upload so I'll use two quarter boxes for those and then this day is um, the birthday party that my son was invited to so I'm actually gonna put in this like fancy scalloped half box for that The party is at like a bounce house place and my son is really <laughs> kind of scared of things that bounce. He just gets very eh, and, and iffy about it but I'm hoping that if there's kids there that he knows and they're playing on it then he'll play on it and kind of get over his fear. I'm hoping. <laughs> I'm hoping. We'll see how that actually works. Uh, See if I can find a thing for filming. I have some filming slates here. They're kind of like a yellowy one that I guess I could use. I have a little green one there. I don't really want to use green though. Because it's on green. So I use the little filming slate. And then this one was the shop sale. Actually, I'm just gonna put oops this little silhouette that I have. i stick it right there in the middle. And birthday party. I have birthday party things. Where are they? There we go. Do I want to use these big balloons? I mean, they're red, but Should I use them or should I use something else? Oh, I don't know. The decisions, the decisions. Actually, this one is perfect. Right here. This little one. It's got like a minty green and a pink balloon. That one is from one of my um, older full kits. Uh... And then editing and uploading, so I need little work things. Um, so I use the computers. Did I forget any icons on this side? Probably. Okay, so for, let's get one for weighing in. I've got some, I've got my jiggers here. I don't have any small scales, but I can use this dumbbell and I'll know what that means. Weighing in. Where's the, I have like pamper stickers here that don't ever get to use. <laughs> Oh, there's like a me time thing in there, but let's see. 
I wish I had like stickers for getting a massage, but I don't ever go get massages very often, so I can't really justify that. Uh, come on. Oh, yes. I'm going to use this little bath that says relax. I think this is from Disco Prince. And it's just so cute. Let me see. I put this bottom one was the massage. So I'm going to put that right there. And then I need to go to El Banco. So... A credit card thing that'll be fine and then the other one is the shop sale is ending so I'm actually gonna use is this gonna make any sense oh I'll use no it begins it begins on here so I'm gonna use a little shopping cart from the kit Wednesday Walmart Charlie's present, so I'll um, use another shopping cart, and a, like, shopping munchkin, oh, yes, I have a shopping munchkin, cute, alrighty, ooh, my phone's gonna fall, so I'm finally on Sunday, Paying Etsy is in there. Um, I'm going to plan next week and I need to meal plan. So. I think I kind of want to put the stripe one in there. Right? Yeah. Okay. So. Meal planning will go right there with a piece of washi and then this half box will go right in there so for meal planning I'll just grab one of these little food icons and then for planning I'm going to use this planner, which is like a really old Scroll Prince Go sticker, but it's green, so it's going there. Okay. So pink and green. So much pink, so much green. All right. So, this is everything that I have left from the kit. Uh, I did use up the heart checklist sheet and the full box sheet. So, I still have a ton of those, a ton of that. And like half of the sheet and most of that. I feel like with these kits, there's so much in them that I just don't use when I'm like doing a whole spread. I feel like I have to pull so much in of the stuff that I normally use that like the majority of the kits don't end up getting used on this actual spread. Um, but that's what this binder is for. However, my half boxes, I've cut myself off from putting more half boxes. I have one, two, I think I have four four front and back things of half boxes so any half boxes that don't fit on these four pages are being de-stashed any quarter boxes that do not fit on this sheet are being de-stashed so forth and such which so um those are all being de-stashed most of this will be stashed anyway uh that is it um after this week, I'm going to be, um, I think I'm going to save the flip through of my planner for the end of the year, but I am going to be doing like a mid-year planner roundup thing where I'm going to go through all the planners that I'm using in the, like currently in the middle of the year versus 
the ones that I set out to use at the beginning of the year and what's changed and why and everything I think that'll be interesting to kind of reflect back on that and see how it's changed in the last six months anyway uh tangent so this is the spread I'm not gonna fill it out on camera honestly because I just don't got time right now but uh you guys will see it filled out when I do the flip through at the end of the year but uh that is that I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. It does really help me out. Um, also, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you later. Bye.